Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to host and follow and do some other things for Mixer on Xbox. So I'm not sure what dashboard you have. Um, I believe everybody's updated to this one. Um, if not, you just want to go to Mixer here at the top. You can hit right bumper to go to it. It's going to show you um, who is featured at the moment here. Um, we have also, you can go to the people you're following only. You can also go click on this to search specific channels. Um, this will show you each of these games, who's broadcasting each one of these games. And then, of course, we have the Mixer Partner Spotlight here at the bottom. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to go over to Following. I'm going to click on that. It'll bring up the Mixer application here. And should fill in everybody that I am currently following only. So then what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to use this... Um, we're gonna choose uh, somebody who is a mod for me right now, so we're gonna use his use him as an example. So once you come to his page or whoever's page you're going to, um, you're gonna want to go up here to the top. I'll show you some different options you can do. First one's gonna be you click on the down arrow here. Um, I'm gonna unfollow, of course, for right now, and then show you that when you come up here to this using your left stick, of course, you can click on follow. It will then follow the person. Okay. Um, <laughs> and it's showing that I'm following him again. All right, so the other options you have here is if you click on your little icon up there. It says you can go to your channel, and you can link a new account, and you can turn notifications on. I believe those notifications are if somebody um, that you follow, that you have notifications set, like say they go online, they're going to stream, it'll send you a notification on your Xbox. Um, so now I'm going to show you how to host. So say you're on this person's page, you want to host them, okay? Um, also, let me just show you this really quickly. Um, if you press Y here to chat, um, it brings up the keyboard. Um, you can say hi or whatever you want to say. Um, it does give you some great options where you can just choose words and then go to the next one, which is very easy. And it's, I enjoy it because I use my um, controller only. So it's very, it's very simple and I just like it simple. So that's all you do. Oh, also if you want to whisper somebody, I'm going to show you how to do that too. So say I wanted to whisper somebody on here. What you're going to do is you're going to bring up the keyboard. You can either press A or Y there. Um, and then what you're going to do is you're going to go in here. You're going to go to this, this slash right here. And then you see how it says whisper. What you're going to do is you're going to go into where it says W. And as soon as you put the W in, that's the only thing that's going to show you there. So that's fine. So then you're just going to press, press enter. See those three little lines at the bottom? So you're just going to hit enter, right? And then it's going to say at. So see how it's bringing up everybody's name in the chat? So then you got to pick which person you're wanting to whisper. So say I wanted to whisper, um, say I want to whisper skilled, right? But there's two people with the S name. Actually, there's three. So what I would do is I'd put in the S. And then you have to really put as many letters as it needs so it brings up only that person's name. You so for skilled, I would want to put a K here. Or, yeah. When I put a K in there, it's going to bring up only his name. Once it does that, you can press enter again in the bottom right-hand corner, which is the three little lines again. It will bring up his name, then I can say, then I can type in whatever I want, say hi, whatever you want to do, whisper, and then you're going to press enter again at the bottom. It's going to put it in there as a whisper. I'll show you. So now it's whispered him that message, okay? So now, if I wanted to host him, I'm going to show you how to do that. You're going to go back up here with your left stick again. You're going to go to your channel. Well, you're going to bring up the this slash. You're going to type in. You, you can see how you have, the, have these other commands that you can type in. So you can use those. So we're just going to type in. Even the H just is going to bring up host. But once you have the H in there and it brings up host only, just press the enter again, which is the three little lines. And then what you're going to do is you're going to type in the name of the person. Of course, I had to pick somebody with a super long name. <laughs> uh, okay, and then once you get that in there, you're going to press Enter. Then what it's going to do is it's going to host him right away. And I just hit the B button to go back. So now I'm going to his channel, right? So then what you can do, so you can go back to his channel then, is just hit your left stick, 
go over here Close. and go back to visit channel so it'll then go back to his channel so then you can now be in his channel and now you've hosted his channel for him which will what it does is it puts it puts his stream on your channel so you're pretty much helping to support that person and showing their channel on yours. So that's basically what you can do on here. Um, so if and if you have any other questions, uh, feel free to put them down in the comments. Um, but that's basically what you do for this, and hopefully that helped. And I'll talk to you guys later. If you have any other videos you'd like to see about Mixer or um, streaming, anything like that, go ahead and put it in the comments. Thank you for stopping by. And uh, click on that like and subscribe if you want. Okay, talk to you later. Bye-bye.